Good morning again, everybody. This is Dell, and we are back in Sky Saga. And I got a helmet on. Hmm. Yeah, I did a little bit. Look at all the messages we have, because I, I played a little bit without recording, just to get some, you know, some of the tedium or some of the stuff you do every single time out of the way, so we could get a little further. Today, though, we're just going to have some fun. Because, darn it, that doesn't happen often enough. Alright, there's our daily adventure. And, um, B. Ooh. So we got a lamp. Oh, that's awesome. A lamp post recipe. I like lamp post. Some warm wood rod. There we go. Delete that. And community quests. Yeah, I didn't hand in too many, but we achieved a total. Oh, that's awesome. 200,000 is what they were looking for on the achievement. And we got 391,000. Awesome. Now, I contributed very little, so... Well, who knows? Maybe we'll get something amazing, something not. Let's go with this one. Ooh. All right. We got a large... We have wall hang... We have decorations. Okay, that's awesome. Uh, we have a crossbones symbol scroll. And learn to use the symbol crossbones. Huh. I'll check out what that is. A black powder bomb. That's scary. Some rose iron ore. Never saw that last time. And some warm wood planks. That is amazing. Tell me I actually picked up everything and didn't drop some of it on the ground. I don't think it would let me pull it out of the mailbox that way. Alright. Hello, little fennec fox. Saw a YouTube video. Didn't actually watch it. Somebody actually has a fennec fox as a pet. I heard they're actually pretty, pretty amazing if you actually do tame them. But that's a little too exotic for my taste right now. Wow, I forgot. We started over. I, I have no space. Oh yeah, this is going to get interesting really fast. <laughs> Whoops. Alright, I picked this up last time. It was a reward on something I did. So we have now a home island title scroll. We're going to use that today. So let's put something away that can be put away easily. Uh, Groundwood planks. I don't think I have room for that. Yeah, I don't have room for any of that stuff. Maybe? Nope, I have brown in there. Oh, what a mess I have. All right, let's equip or put on our bar all the different stuff we need to learn. We also picked up a stone sar sarcophagus B recipe, so we're going to learn how to do that. And I think that's the extent of that kind of thing. Oh, what's this? Oh, and another recipe. So many recipes. I can get some serious cleaning done. Let's put this down here, too, and see what we do with it. All right, so number two first. We don't want to have a crash site anymore. We're going to have a home. Yay, we have a home. We don't have just a crash site. Now we need to make it our home. This is not looking terribly homey. Number two, we will learn the first recipe. Large bamboo wall hanging. Very awesome. We need a wood rod, some leather, which we don't have. We need rope. We need vine rope. Okay, there we go. Impress your friends, terrify your foes. Got it. All right, decor. Number two, sarcophagi. Not quite sure how that's going to actually fit, but it could look kind of cool outside as a bench type of situation. We need carved stone pieces and stone slabs. Those are easy to come by. That's not a big deal. All right, number four. Learn how to make this type of recipe. Keystone will open a, a portal to a moderately challenging adventure. That's for when we have time. It takes nine keystone fragments, and it looks like we make them out of whatever kind we happen to have. And last but not least, what is this? Crossbones? Oh, very awesome. I didn't even know we could actually specialize that. So we, and there's the purple, and notice our armor's all purple. So we can actually change our signature color. I like the purple. We're sticking with it. We are level 2 settler, level 2 explorer, and we have not PvP'd. Cancel, we're good with all that. Oh, very awesome. Shows the islands we've actually done and the photos that I've unintentionally taken, or that I did take, of our last place. Very cool we got to keep that. Zero wins, zero losses. Yeah, not surprised. Okay, I'm happy. So many awesome things. All right, so that's what all that was. That should give us a little room in here, which is good. All right, so I think we're just going to... Let's hit C. <laughs> that doesn't tell us much. You make it using a metal 
plate in the anvil, which we have not even made yet. And it is a gladiator item. All right, so that's a PvP item. Um, I'm going the wrong way. I need to be to Oh, hey, look. We also have a large blacksmith chest recipe. I haven't put on my bars yet. But that away, that away. We'll clean this up in a second here. My chest is full, of course. Let's put all these together. Put all the wood together. That goes down there. The ore can go together. That kind of fits more that spot. There's some wool fleece. Uh, anything else that we can stuff in here that might actually fit? Oh, another one. There's a lamppost recipe. I am blind. I wouldn't be surprised if you guys were yelling at me in the background going, Hey! Hey! You! Pay attention! Um, let's take some sand. We can use it to to do things, maybe. Some actual white wool fleece. There's the sun steel plates. We'll take some clay with us and drop off instead. Hmm. Hmm. The ore, which we'll put down here. Uh, we'll do the same with the earth stone, which we can easily get more of, and we'll drop off. What do you guys think? We're going to use that. That's warm wood. I guess we'll drop off some of that. Okay. We'll take that with us since it's common. And we'll take that with us since we have an, a quest for it. I'm feeling moderately okay about where we're at here. There we go. Uh, move that. This is looking moderately organized, too. Alright, so we have way too much in our bags. Totally agree with that process. Throw that in there if we're going to use it in a second. Go back to two. We're going to learn to use... make this. A large chest used by a blacksmith to store materials. So... It takes metal weight, which is easy once we make our woodworking bench. A metal rod and some... yeah, not too bad. That's doable. And three. This we make on our woodwork bench, which we have not made, and we simply need some glass planes to go with that. Oh, I'm excited about all this. Alright, so that's that. I think I'm going to pause the recording for a few minutes here. What am I doing? Oh, I'm eating a mushroom. Good morning, sunshine. I'm going to pause the recording for a second and... Whoops. I actually didn't mean to pick up snow. R. R. Rucksack. Give me that back. Let's put the snow back down. Drop it in that hole. There we go. I'm going to clean this up a little bit and break. Could I? I think I'm blind. Did it tell me to hold the pick up? I think it did. We don't need stone fragments hanging around. Like, yeah, I think we're going to clean up this area and get a bunch of sky iron ore. It doesn't go that far back and it might be a good spot to start put in our chests. Be right back. Alright, that looks a whole lot more open and more well lit. More well lit, more better lit. Yay. I didn't even realize that was hanging down like that. Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to go into our rucksack here. At least the R button that pulls up our hand crafting and we need some devices. In fact, we end up needing at least the top three of these and eventually, well that's just general, they actually burn out. So, um... That, I didn't realize. I didn't read the last part of that. Provides warmth and a place to rest once placed, which, you know, when you're out adventuring and you start taking damage and eat and it doesn't turn the right color, if you lay down at a campfire, it gives you that back, which is awesome. I didn't realize that if you're defeated, it actually brings you back to your actual, the last place you actually slept. I should have, because I think I remember that happening last time. Either way, neither here nor there. We need to build a stone forge. The good news is we just mined up a whole bunch of rock. So this takes, here's your information, you can, by the way, I dragged it this time, you can just right click it in. Uh, we need six of them, takes three seconds to make, and we do make this in our hands, which kind of makes sense. It makes sense mainly because you really need to be able to, you know, get it done. Alright, let's see where we're going to put this thing here. It's heavy, we walk decently slowly. Oh, I like it. It's in a crate. That's awesome. Um, what do you guys think? Here? 
and then put one more there and one there and then put chests around it or should we put it on the side and make a wall of chests? I'm thinking wall of chests so let's put this right there and it can melt that's awesome it can melt the snow next to it It'll make it nice and warm and toasty down here alright so using the forge lets us make decorative jewels carved stone pieces belt buckles all kinds of things this is only the things that we have availability in our um, uh, bags right now, a rucksack. Interesting. Oh! Oh, we can cook meat now! That is awesome. Craft. So that's what that is. So the original looks like that, which is what we got last time raw. Now the raw meat looks like this. And we have to cook it. Raw beetle meat. Mmm. Not sure about that, but hey, you eat what you have to eat, right? Right. Mm-hmm. Yuck. What else do we have? Recipes. We can make metal. Oh, okay. So if we want to have metal building blocks. And of course the wood. Which is tedious and long. Much easier I found last time. And I hope it's true this time to cannibalize a uh, adventure fort that you go to. Alright, so let's see what else we have that we need. Nothing else in there at the moment. So go back to... not that. Rucksack. Hand crafting. What do we need to make our workbench? We need wooden planks, a metal rod, and some metal bolts. Now I know I don't have the metal bolts. Let's go see if we have the rest of that. I'm nom food in my hand. One in each hand. Let's take that out. There we go. That's better. Alright. Metal bolts, no, but we do have some metal rods. And we definitely... was that all? That's not what I wanted to hit. That. We have six metal rods. We're golden there. We have no wooden planks, but I can pull some out. And we have no metal bolts, which I need to make. But I have a bunch of sky iron ore, so I know I can make that. Ah, uh, wood, wood, wood. Where's the wood? E. There we go. Let's stick with our standard ground wood plank. Easy to come by. Oh, and hey, check it out. We have a completed quest. We haven't even started that today. Oh, I don't need this. Yes, I do. Metal bolts. Alright, so metal bolts can be made with any type of metal ore. We have 75. Let's toss that in and craft ourselves four metal bolts. It takes 30 seconds this time. You can walk away. It shows you the progress above it, which is awesome. And you can have three things total. Two of those in queue, one currently making. Alright, let's look at what else we need to make while we're doing this. Our, our, um, that wants to tell us something. That's that. Now the anvil, we need three metal weights and two stones. Let's go look over here. Did I have any metal weights? I do not. We need to make those as well. Now let's go back. If you see, it's ready. Once we go over, it gives it to us. We don't actually have to pick it up. It just hands it to us at that point. Alright, metal weights made with metal ore. Again, you can right click it in. Craft takes 30 seconds. We'll close that and check out our recipes again. So now we can make this one. So we'll go ahead and click it in. Wooden plank, rods, and a bolt. Yay! And as soon as... Okay, that's ready now, isn't it? Did it give it to us? No, it's almost ready. As soon as that's ready, and we picked it up. Not E, R. We can go ahead and make those in and stone. And we can make our metal anvil. Here's an interesting thing down here. And I have, this is one thing I'm hoping I find more information on this time around. Different materials will have different effects on the item you craft. So I'm kind of guessing that means different metals make better tools, armor, etc. Oh, do I have to turn that in? Do I need to make two of those? Rucksack, quests. Hand in five wool. Hand in an anvil. So we need to actually turn that in. I'm going to guess they're not... Oh, our anvil is broken and without it we're unable to build. Can you bring us a new one? Alright, we can do that. I don't think we have the recipe for that, but we'll check in a second. Let's go make a second anvil while we're at it, while we have everything in our bags. Keep trying to use that. That's not what I need. These are handcrafted. No. 
we need more metal weights, which means we need to use this. We want metal weights. We need to toss in sky iron ore. While that's going, we're going to go ahead and put the ones we already have made, rucksack, on our bar. There's that, and there's that one. Three. We'll do this one first. That looks good because I'm pretty sure that... No, five. That is just as wide, so we'll put that there. That looks awesome. And three, we will put... Leave a space? Yes. You can always move it. Now, to think you put these down, as I said, you can always move it. You simply hold E until it goes all the way around, pick it back up, and then put it down where you want it. Simple enough. Alright, you gave me what I needed now. Rucksack. Let's complete this quest. Click. Click. Craft. A whole three seconds. We are good. Look at that anvil. Alright, next, let's see if that wooden bench is over here on this. There we go. The chair. What kind do we need? Q. Um, where'd you go? Ground wood chair. So just standard ground wood. Click you. What do you need? You just need wooden planks. We have plenty. We'll make ourselves a ground wood chair. Well, that's working. Let's look at the last thing we want to be making. A bow. Doesn't specify what kind. I believe you make it here. And we need more metal weights for that. So, let's go back over here. This metal weight recipe, man, I'll tell you, I'm using a ton of it. I'm glad we moved all that ore over here. This is why we're even able to do it. Because I, they do give you some really nice starting resources to get yourself moving with. Which is awesome. Alright, that's ready to turn in. Come on, a little faster. In the meantime, we'll get some of these stones off the ground. Or stones. Bones. I speak English. So have I ever told you guys that we are teaching the twins sign language? I have to be honest, it was probably the best thing we ever started doing. I absolutely love it. It's very, very awesome when um, they can tell us what they need or want long before they actually totally master the word. Most of the time they do the word which doesn't sound like what it's supposed to be at the same time as telling us. Oh, I need wooden rods. Okay, let's go over here. Did I have rod How many wooden rods? Did I have any? No! Okay. How many wooden rods do I need? Let's go back. Hello, you think. I need 12 wood rods. Now I'm pretty sure those are made in here. Wood rods. There we go. Looks like you get 8 for every 4. So we're going to craft and craft. That gives us 16 and we still have enough to turn in the quest, although we are going to have to gather some more wood. Quest wise, those are all adventure things. We need to go harvest some more wool and this will be the last one we have to do to... Not quite. Did you guys see that last one? Green keystone fragments. Hello, keystone fragments that are green. I need some of you. Okay, thanks. Bye. Okay, I like that up in the top. If you guys look up in the top left-hand corner of my screen right now, it's actually telling us what is available to be picked up. Alright, there we go. We got those that we needed. We'll pick up the first eight. Get impatient. Be excited about all the things that are complete. Come on. A little faster. Give it here. Yay! Okay, we have it. And we can make our first bow. There it is. Click that in. Click those in. That's working. Could also make ourselves a better shield. Hmm. I have plenty of those. I have enough of those left. Let's do it. Alright. Stone. Wood. And metal bolt. A stone shield. Nice. We're upgrading ready. Our sword's looking okay. Now there's, there's something else we can look at while we're waiting. So the other thing... 
guys didn't see me last season, we can repair our items. We can dismantle things, but we can also repair them. So we can take this, drop it in here, and it will tell us what it needs to be fixed completely. The questions I'm not sure on is... Um, that's interesting. The less durability an item has, the more resources it'll need to be repaired. I'm not sure if the durability affects the... Uh, what's the word for it? Come on, somebody give me the word. The... The... Damage amount it does. AKA, if you have a sword in Minecraft, it doesn't matter how damaged it is, it still does the same amount of damage until it breaks. But, if you are in Fallout, if your gun is half broken, it does less damage. So, not sure which way we're at on that one. Okay, how long do these take? Doesn't tell us, does it? Unless we're making it at the moment. Boy, does that feel like it takes forever, though. Alright, we don't need that yet. That can stay here for us. Now, we're going to go up, because I like taking the actual Zeppelin thingy out here. Our little sh airship. We're going to go turn in these quests, so I will be right back. Yay, social hub! And I'm pretty sure the majority of what we have to turn in is over here. And we should be able to pick up some extra quests in the meantime. Especially if we're going on an adventure. Hello dude with the awesome blue helmet. I love blue. Favorite color ever. Green's up there, but blue is amazing. Alright, we can hand these in. Those. Yay, good job. 20 of those, one of those, one of those, and one of those. And we level three blue fabric sheets. Oh, if I hadn't made that, we would actually have those with us. 15 pumpkins, 15 mushrooms. Let's just grab them all. I can accept zero more quests, and that's all it's done. So it's not even worth walking over to the gentleman who does our... Yeah, those aren't even worth it yet. Is there a new quest for the community? Oh, hi. Right, rank three. Third. Me. Oh, me. That wasn't that great. Let's go see if there's a new community quest, and then I'll head back, and I'm probably going to make... Gotta make some chests. I don't want to go on an adventure with my bags, like, almost totally full. Okay, see, that guy has those... That's cool. I like his. I have the skull and crossbones. He here. I have cross crossbones, and he has that. Work together to hand in... Okay, so it's back to the bone fragments again. Which, I technically have some right now. How many do you have to have? Okay, not sure how many. We'll worry about that later. See, there's another guy. There's somebody that has... Oh, okay, those are just our vendors. Herb -derp. Sorry. Alright, I got that. And... No, that is, a, that is another guy. He's green and has that. We're going to head back, clean out some bags, and I will be right back. 